Hey everyone, it's me, JB, and we are in week 42. And so, since we are going deeper, we are taking it back to week 16, where our verse came from Galatians 5, 22 through 23. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, forbearance, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Against such things there is no law. Live in kindness. So, y'all... After this, we are officially caught up. I am, I am so happy to be caught up. So we'll be going back to our red, regular, um, our regular schedule. So our Inspire Day is Monday, and so these videos will go up on Monday. Um, hopefully without any fail. Um, hopefully I do not get sick or anything craziness happens. Um, I am vitamin C in it up. I'm doing whatever it takes to stay well. So let's get into our questions. So our first question. So do you consider yourself kind? Now, I know what you're thinking when I ask this question. Like, well, most people would consider themselves kind, but there are a lot of people that will honestly tell you that they don't consider themselves a kind person. So this is something that you just really need to ask yourself. Like, do you consider yourself kind? Because if you are a Christ follower and you're thinking to yourself, you know what, I don't consider myself kind. We, we know from what the Bible says is that, the, um, that this is one of the fruit of the Spirit. So this is something that we need to work on possessing. So do you consider yourself kind? And if you don't consider yourself kind, then of course, that's something that you need to work on and trying to get to the root of why you aren't kind. Or maybe you need to just ask a few people because sometimes um, some people don't consider themselves something, but other people may consider themselves that. Um, I've had that happen to me a few times where um, someone has said that I was something and I didn't consider myself that and so I was like wow I didn't I didn't think of myself as that type of person so it was a good thing I mean sometimes people say things and it's not a good thing it was um, but just ask around if you were just like you know you're not a kind per person ask a few people see if they agree if they agree with you and then if they don't then maybe you're being a little bit too hard on yourself now if they agree with you now it's time to get in prayer and kind of seek that kindness and, and asking God to soften your heart. But if you do consider yourself a kind person, now can you even can you be kind even when the other people around you aren't kind to you? Because it's easy to be kind to that person who's already nice. But what about that person who's not so nice? What about that person who gets a little bit rowdy with you? What about that person who's a little bit rude? Can you still be kind to that person no matter what, no matter how they are? Can you still give them that? So we are going deeper. So as we go deeper, we have to kind of more just try to live in that kindness, but going deeper and realizing that that the kindness is not something that is when it works for us. It's something that we need to try to have always. And so just looking at yourself and noticing those moments that you aren't kind. I know on this journey, and I even said this in, I believe in the, in the same week's video, that as I go on this journey, um, even though all of these things, I'm not living out, you know, perfectly, which I'll never will, or even close to perfectly, it's at least making me aware of different things. It's making me aware of the fact that if I want to be more Christ-like, these are the things, these are the things that I want to have. These are the attributes that I want to possess or the attributes I don't want to possess. So it's just being aware. And so I, I um, like I told y'all, walking dead, self-awareness is a beautiful thing. So we're going to keep on going deeper as we live at peace in strength with faith 
in perseverance, without complaining to listen, without anger, without fear, with patience and love, with humility and joy and rest, with integrity, with compassion and in kindness. So now we're going to go deeper.